Hey guys, I'm Nisha Homi. Today I'm sharing a super healthy sandwich rich in probiotics, protein and fiber. Ideal as a filling, gut friendly meal any time of the day in your weight loss journey. So let's get started with the recipe. For the sandwich filling, I'm heating my kadai with the 1 to 2 teaspoons of wood pressed groundnut oil. Instead of wood pressed groundnut oil, you can use any locally sourced wood pressed oil of your choice or even A2 desi ghee. Once the oil is heated, I'm adding in half teaspoon jeera, also known as cumin seeds. Once the jeera splutters, reduce the flame to the lowest, add in half teaspoon sauf, also known as fennel seeds. Add in one cup of green moong sprouts. I have already shared how to make green moong sprouts. Links will be updated below this video. Please do check it out. Half teaspoon sea salt or as needed. Give this a good mix. Add in a splash of water. Cover and allow the moong sprouts to steam cook for about 2 minutes on medium to low flame. 2 minutes later, open the lid. Give it a stir. 1 third teaspoon turmeric powder. Half teaspoon Kashmiri chilli powder. Give it a good mix and allow the spices to get lightly roasted. It should take about 20 to 30 seconds. Add in 1 cup cooked chickpeas. So what I've done is I soaked the chickpeas overnight and the next day morning I pressure cooked it for about 15 minutes. I also added a little salt while cooking the chickpeas. Chickpeas are also known as chana. So I'm adding in 1 cup of cooked chana. Give it a good mix. Half teaspoon jeera powder. Mix well. Once everything is nicely mixed, turn off the flame. Squeeze in half a lemon and lightly mash the chana with a potato masher. And my protein rich sandwich filling is ready. I'm going to allow this to cool down. Now, as always, the best thing about these fillings are you can store it in an airtight glass container once it has cooled down and it will stay good in the refrigerator for about three to four days. So this way it's an ideal way to meal prep. So I'm going to allow it to cool down. Note that I have lightly mashed the chickpeas. I'm using two slices of sourdough bread to make this sandwich. To crisp up this sandwich bread slices, I'm heating my cast iron tawa and I'm adding in a little bit of wood pressed groundnut oil. And I'm placing the sourdough bread slice on top and I'm crisping up the sourdough bread slices. Once both sides are toasted and is crisp, remove it to a plate. Repeat the same thing with the other slice as well. I have sliced one onion thinly and to season the onion, I'm adding in a fat pinch of sea salt. 1 4 teaspoon Kashmiri chilli powder, a squeeze of lemon juice and with my hand I am mixing all this really well. And I am going to keep the seasoned onions aside. To assemble the sandwich I am placing one slice of the toasted sourdough bread, placing some sliced tomatoes on top, a sprinkle of sea salt on the tomatoes, place the protein rich chana sprouts filling, 2 to 3 tablespoon or as needed. To make this gut friendly and probiotic rich, I'm adding in one tablespoon of my homemade sauerkraut. I have already shared how to make sauerkraut at home. Please do check it out. Links will be updated below this video. Next, I'm adding in the seasoned sliced onions on top and some radish microgreens on top. Place the other slice on top and lightly press it down. And my super healthy sandwich is ready to serve. So guys do try this healthy sandwich recipe and let me know in the comments how it turned out. Thank you for watching and until next time take care. Bye bye.